What is up, guys? Hey, it's been a hot minute. I apologize for the lack of content, uh, but I've been super busy. I've uh, been racing and doing a few things like that. Been having an absolute blast racing. So uh, anxious to see what this winter is going to bring on getting the car prepped and ready with a new body and a few other goodies. Getting ready for next season. And uh, hopefully we can uh, take that car to the front. Say so this year it's been quite a learning process, let me tell you. But uh, yeah, so we'll turn you around and you can check out how the car looks now. See, I know I did a brief, you know, little video over it before. And uh, yeah, it was all brand new basically at that point in time a little beat up now just an fyi but uh yeah we'll get you all into the shop and we'll take a look at what's got what's it got going on so here you go Well, with all that there, as you've seen in the little clips, it's been a learning curve this year for me, learning how to run the car and all that good stuff. But uh, for most of y'all, I know y'all are all truck enthusiasts and wanted to watch crew cab build and everything like that, but I wanted to branch out a little bit. I wanted to show you all what else I got going on. You know, maybe I something else I do that catches your attention. You want to see more of it or something? Drop it down in the comments. We'll see what we can make happen. But uh, yeah, so car is a 2010 larry shaw chassis it is a usra car it is a b modified so you know runs a small block chevy for the uh for the engine on it two-speed transmission and a quick change rear end with all that it makes it a blast to run i've had some very good times on the track and some very rough times as you can tell with all that like i've said i'm learning i'm learning but i have been passing cars here recently and moving towards the front so like i said we're gonna get her rebuilt or well just the body basically everything else is still solid but we're gonna go through add a few upgrades and just put a new body on it and i need some ideas for a wrap anybody got any ideas i got a few things i got up my sleeve but we'll see and uh, now we're going to step outside and we're going to do a crew cab update along with some other things I've acquired over this short amount of time. So here y'all go. guys those are all the rides because you could say that i've had right now so uh yeah everybody knows the old crew cab and most of y'all should know the og fourth gen but there's this little guy right here i actually ended up scoring a pretty decent deal on so i bought it i'm gonna fix it and i'm gonna flip it so if any of y'all are interested and in the central missouri area I'm going to be posting on a marketplace here before too long after I do two little repairs to it. But yeah, we'll uh, spin you around here and we'll get you talking to you about some stuff we're going to get ready to do to the crew cab. All right, so onto the crew cab here now. As y'all can see, we fixed up some exhaust on it and got it running out the back now instead of an axle dump. No more black tailgate. Uh, that was driving me nuts. Um, currently still don't have wheels for the crew cab. Been stealing them off the fourth gen to take it to shows and you know have all the fun with it but uh yeah so now on the agenda for it is something suspension wise 
and wheels and tires. And then also, should I paint these fender liners? Because I'm really debating it. They're looking kind of dingy. And don't judge too hard. The truck's been sitting in the shop. It needs a good bath. I said it got rinsed off tonight, but it needs a good bath. But yeah. Rock chips still have not been repaired. I am getting ready to do that this winter while everybody's building their trucks. I'm going to redo this thing again. So yeah. With that being said, hopefully come on the beginning of show season. This thing's going to be looking fresh on some new wheels, a lift, and uh, fresh paint. So, yeah. Hopefully it'll be a showstopper by then. We'll see. But I always want to hop on here and let you all know that I'm still here. And I haven't forgot about you all. And, uh, yeah. We will keep you updated on updates on the crew cab. Might even bring you along the ride on me fixing that up to, you know, flip it and make a little couple bucks. And then, fortune. Yeah. She's just going to stay the same. So, Before I end this video, I wanted to uh, show you all something else. We'll get it in the light here. I'll turn you around. So here, we've been playing with some powder coat. Got Illusion Blueberry, Super Chrome, and just some Harbor Freight White, which was obviously garbage. But, like I said, I've been practicing with some powder coat, so... You all keep that in the back of your minds on what I may be having up my sleeve. So, but there we go with the end of that. Thank you all. We'll see you all in the next one. All right, guys. So I kind of left you all on a cliffhanger on the last clip that I took. But uh, yeah, we did something tonight. Hope you almost seen it. Let's get you turned around here and take a look. setup on the truck make sure you drop a like share and subscribe and we'll see you all in the next one thank you for watching